Hey guys, I'm Ralph from Godspeed Photography, and today we're going to talk about the 2018 MacBook Pro issue of having a pink screen, pink or purple screen, when you open it up. And I looked it up, and apparently it's an ongoing issue for years. Um, so I took it to uh, Apple in um, Sherman Oaks, um, and they said that this uh, specific uh, MacBook is not covered under any repair program. And um, as I was reading online, uh, there are some that are covered. I believe the 13 inches are covered, maybe um, a little bit, uh, 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 a few models before this. And I was talking to the guy and he's saying, you know, like if, if the serial number isn't under that repair program, they really can't do anything about it, but this is uh, an ongoing issue. And if you type in flex gate or purple screen, pink screen, um, I've, I've found a lot of people have this issue as well. And it's just, it's just unfortunate. Um, the good thing is it's not the pink screen of death. It's only the display. Um, actually, if I close it a certain way, I can see the screen. There we go. I don't know if you guys can see that, but um, I can actually log in. And um, what I'm planning to do, well, I don't want to spend $700 for the repair. That's kind of crazy, right? Like that's a little bit more than half with it, um, just to get a new uh, notebook. Um, uh, for me, unfortunately, I loaded this baby up um, upgraded all the RAM and all the stuff and you know I think it's I got the i9 processor at the time um, and also the uh, hard drive so I got another two three good years out of this notebook um, this MacBook and I'm just hoping that Apple comes up with a repair program um, it's it's just really kind of terrible and you know I'm kind of stuck in a place where the new M1 uh, MacBook Pros are going to be coming out. So I don't want to drop $700, have this repaired, where I can spend that $700, um, you know, at, um, spend a little bit, I'd, I'd rather spend a little bit more money um, and get like a new, faster, more powerful MacBook rather than drop $700 for a repair. That it's, it's this uh, no, MacBook is just three years old, you know. Um, I have a 2016, even my 20, 2014 MacBooks still work, it doesn't have this issue. So here we go again, let's, let's open it up. So it is definitely a cable and you would think that would be an easy fix. It's such a, such a waste that a cable, um, you know, the fix for that would have to be a replacement of the whole entire display. That's just, I don't know, that's just bad design in my opinion. Um, so. Uh, hopefully, I'll be um, writing up a report on uh, on Apple's website or you know whatever that process is, and hopefully a lot of people, you know, everyone that's experiencing this issue, also submits those reports. If it's if it's rampant enough, I think they'll come up with a repair program. In the meantime, I'm just gonna stick an external monitor on this thing and work off that. But it really uh, takes away from the fact that this is uh, you know portable. Right, so kind of in a really bad place um, as far as this goes. Good thing I have another computer that I'm using, but I'm losing the portability, work, being able to work um, somewhere else remotely. Um, anyway, yeah, so send Apple some uh, reports, some complaints, and hopefully they come up with a repair program. All right, that's it for now. See you guys later.